admittedly, uh, I was quite tanked with my friend and we came home and we took a bottle of rum from my cupboard and we walked down to Balmoral Beach and we went into the sailing club and we found a rowboat and we stole the rowboat and we rowed the boat over Sydney Harbour in the middle of the night drinking nothing but rum. Only about an hour into this journey did we realise how obscenely dangerous this was. We are in the middle of Sydney Harbour at night time. There's still like boats flying past. How big is this boat? It is a rowboat, Tom. Like it's it like tiny. what I'm imagining you in this small dinghy kind tiny. of thing. Like that's what it is, right? It's a boat that they have to row out to other sailboats. Right, to boats that there. ought to be on yeah. the harbour, yeah. Yeah, so <laughs> we're, in, we're in the middle of the harbour and we're like, this is bad. One of the oars breaks and we're like, we could die. For this and the entire time we were talking like pirates yeah and that became unfunny when we realized we could die but we didn't let the panic get into us so we continued to talk like pirates to the very end we turned up sometime in the morning four hours later at manly beach and then we got out and we're like oh god this is a terrible idea and we got um the uh yeah a taxi home but we called the police to tell them that we'd stolen the boat because we were overcome with guilt and uh <laughs> we're like Hello, <laughs> this is Captain Clayton. That's not my real name. <laughs> Why are we talking like a pirate? Well, we stole a boat. <laughs> we just wanted to tell you. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and there's an anonymous line. So, yeah, we call the... Um, an, an anonymous boat stealing line. Yeah, well, a police line, if you give them a tip. Just, yeah, just a heads up to everyone watching. If you do anything illegal or you see something illegal and you don't want to tell them your name, there is an anonymous line. You can tip them off yeah. and it won't come back to you legally. So, is that right? Yeah, we were honest. We, we told them that we stole the boat. And um, What happened when one of the ore broke? Like, did you just go in circles for a Good question. Yeah. I kept it and I kept the, the end of the uh, – and my friend didn't realise. Yeah. And then 10 years later – I got that framed and it hang, it's hung on his wall as a trophy of friendship. That's great. Yeah. And so he's got that <laughs> to his day yeah, like against the wall. That's awesome. Hey! Ba-dum. If you'd like to watch the full interview, there'll be a link, obviously. You won't have to work too hard for it. It's also available in podcast forms for those with better things to do than watch our stupid heads. <laughs>